I'm going to show you how to make wonton noodle soup. Often, we enjoy a noodle soup or a wonton soup. In this dish, we have both. I'm also going to show you how to make a special seasoning for a delicious Chinese lotus leaf taste. To prepare the broth, put one pound chicken wings and chicken bones in a saucepan. You can use chicken carcasses or pork bones. Then add one onion cut in half, two ginger slices, three cloves of garlic, crush and peeled. One teaspoon of small dry shrimp, which bring umami to the broth. Also add two tablespoons of light soy sauce, two tablespoons of fish sauce, one tablespoon of salt, and ten cups of water. Put on high heat with the lid. At the start of boiling, skimmer to keep the broth clear. Put the lid back on and let simmer over low heat for one hour. You can also prepare this broth the day before. During this time, make the aromatic seasoning. Slice four shallots. Chop five cloves of garlic. Grate a piece of ginger to get one teaspoon. In a small saucepan, heat it over high heat. Put half cup of vegetable oil. When the oil is hot, add the shallots and regularly stir for four minutes. The shallots start to take color, turn to low heat and add the garlic and ginger, two star anise, one cinnamon, two bay leaves that I crush to release their flavor. Regularly stir for 3 minutes and 30 seconds. The ingredients in this seasoning are among those due to flavor picking ducks. The mixture begins to be golden and a good aroma is released. Turn off the heat and continue stirring for 20 seconds. You can also prepare it the day before. To make the wonton stuffing, use two chicken thighs. Remove the skin and bone. Cut them into pieces. Chop them with one clove of garlic. Put them in a mixing bowl. Chop half pound of shrimp with the knife. So we will enjoy some pieces in the dumplings. You can also chop them in a blender. Put them with the meat. Then add one quarter teaspoon of grated ginger, one quarter teaspoon of salt, one quarter teaspoon of ground paper, one tablespoon of fish sauce, one tablespoon of oyster sauce, one tablespoon of light soy sauce, one tablespoon of chosen cooking wine, one tablespoon of sesame oil, and one teaspoon of cornstarch. Mix until getting a sticky stuffing. Slice six spring onion. Put most of it in the stuffing and keep the rest to sprinkle on the bones at the end. Mix again. The stuffing is ready. Cut the cilantro into sections. Cut one bok choy in four. Use store-bought wonton wrappers. They are practical. You can also watch my video to learn how to make these wrappers. Making wonton dumplings is very easy. Take a wrapper, place one teaspoon of stuffing in the center. Close by pinching the edges of the wrapper. The broth simmered for one hour. Remove the wings and bones. Save the wings for another meal. Take one cup of broth. Put it aside of the heat. Untangle four portions of the thin egg noodles. Cook one portion at a time. 
in the pot of boiling water over high heat. Stir a little and let it cook for 40 seconds. Drain them and place them in a bowl that will be served. Bring the broth to a boil over medium-high heat. Put the wonton, they will cook for 6 minutes. Stir them briefly to prevent them from sticking to the bottom. When it boils again, pour in the cup of the broth set aside and which has cooled, and continue cooking. This helps cool everything down. This gives the stuffing time to cook well, without the wrapper becoming too soft. Put the bok choy in the broth for one minute and remove them. The wonton are cooked. Cut the fire. Divide them with the broth into the bowls with the noodles. In each bowl, add a piece of bok choy, a little cilantro, spring onion, and one tablespoon of aromatic seasoning. This complete dish will delight all your guests. Bon appétit! The aromatic seasoning gives the soup flavors of picking duck. Homemade wonton are delicious and really easy to make. Thank you. See you at the next homemade dish on Morgan Recipes.